In this video, we'll discuss seven properties of a square. Our first property is that all sides are the same length. So what it means is that the line AB is equal to BC is equal to CD is equal to DA. And we indicate equal length with a little line through those sides. I can write it as AB is equal to BC equal to CD equals to DA. So now we can see that all four sides are equal in length. The second property is both pairs of opposite sides are parallel. So what it means is that AB is parallel to CD and BC is parallel to AD. We indicate parallel lines by using a little arrow on the sides that are parallel to one another. So you can see that the line AB and DC have two arrows. So that means that those two lines are parallel to one another. And the line BC and AD each have one arrow. So it shows that those two lines are parallel to one another. We can write it mathematically as AB is parallel, so with two lines, to CD. And BC is parallel to the line AD. Our third property is that the interior angles are all 90 degrees. So the interior angles are referring to the angles on the inside of the square. And this property is saying that all of these angles are equal to 90 degrees. Now, could you notice in mathematics, we indicate 90 degrees with a little square in the corner. So when you see those little squares, it means that that angle is 90 degrees. I can write it as angle A is equal to angle B, and that's equal to angle C, equal to angle D, and all four of these angles are equal to 90 degrees. The fourth property is that diagonals are equal in length. So a diagonal is a line that goes from one corner to another corner of the square. And this property is saying that the line from A to C is equal to the line from B to D. So you can see we have two diagonals and these two diagonals are equal in length. Mathematically, we can write it as the line AC is equal to the line BD. Number five, diagonals bisect at right angles. So here where the diagonals meet, I'm gonna mark that with the letter E. Property five links with property seven, which is diagonals bisect one another. So the word bisect means to cut each other in half. So this line AC is cutting BD in half, and the line BD is cutting AC in half. And they intersect at 90 degrees. So for this property, I'm simply going to write it as angle E is equal to 90 degrees. Property number six, diagonals bisect the angles. So now we have the diagonals. And what this is saying is it's cutting angles in half. So the angle A would be cut into two equal pieces. And if the whole angle A is 90 degrees, then each of those little sides is 45 degrees. So diagonals bisect the interior angles. So all of these angles now are cut in half. So they will be 45 degrees, 45, 45, all the way through. Number seven, diagonals bisect each other, as I've explained in property number five. What this means is that these diagonals cut each other in half. And those lines show that AE is equal to BE, is equals to CE, is equals to DE. And how we can write that is we say AE equal to BE, equal to C, E, equal to D, E. And those are the seven properties of a square.